Hello, welcome to my new video. Today I want to show you film uh, Deadpool and Deadpool 2 full slips from Film Arena and a German slip sheet full slip edition. Um, before I begin, um, the last video I showed you the French edition and I forgot to show you the posters. It's simply huge. It's a huge, huge, huge poster. The first one, it's actually the same artwork as on the front side of the of the full slip uh, edition and uh, the same artwork as in uh, um, Film Arena still books. The second poster, huge and beautiful, it's the back side of the Film Arena edition and still book. Just beautiful. Now to the full slips. Uh, it's uh, um, uh, two hard boxes from Film Arena. They are called that way, hard boxes. Some kind of one-click editions from Film Arena. Each one has uh, two full slips. So every one is no has a number. This one is number five. Uh, the second one is number sixteen. This beautiful, beautiful Film Arena usual structure. And it's the other hard box. It's incredibly beautiful artwork. It's like the post artwork, as I said before. And oh, that's just incredible. Number 16. Um, yeah, and now to the both uh, Dead Film and Deadpool editions. Uh, the first one, uh, the stillbook is the same, Justice has a new face. Stillbook is the same, but uh, the content booklet and and cards are completely different. And that's a lenticular edition, as usual, lenticular uh, the non-lenticular edition has an additional lenticular uh, magnet, lenticular cover for the stillbook, and the lenticular edition does not have it. So. Usually every edition has at least one lenticular. It's a beautiful 3D lenticular. So now the same still book. And it's here is the Film Arena lenticular cover. It's pretty difficult to show because it's so dark. It's actually a flip-flop cover. Well, uh, feminine editions are really great, but some of their lenticulars are not the best, fortunately. Now to the booklets. So, now to the booklets. It's from the first one. Both are um, art booklets only. I won't show all the pictures. Oh, that's nice. Not uh, the movies are great, but the, this artwork is not that great. Nothing in comparison to, for example, uh, Ready Player One or Aquaman artwork. It's not that stunning. It's a very, very fun, uh, very, very satirical movie that uh, um, references lots of blockbusters and lots of cliches. Very fun, right? I thought the second one was uh, a little bit better. The Ryan Reynolds is, is, is Deadpool. He is the perfect choice for Deadpool. The first time that Deadpool appeared in in, uh, in the X Men universe, it was uh, X Men um, Origins Wolverine, and it was it was also Ryan Reynolds, but it, the character was uh, didn't do uh, Deadpool justice like at all. It looked completely different with completely. Uh, different powers 
and uh, both movies make fun of of the of this um, incarnation of Deadpool. Now to the still book, a crazy embossed still book, really crazy, very creative. Half the second half of the face, Deadpool. So if you, oh perfect, if you have both of them, you can combine it to a face. Very cool. So now to the content. Uh, well, uh, I bought them new, but one of the discs was missing. Well, it's, since there are two editions, it's not that bad. It's it's much it's it's much better than if if some some of the cards of some of the goodies were missing because the discs there are two of them. So here's the artwork inside, not the breast. Really good. Well, all cards are stored in these bags, and it's a pain to remove them. We have uh, here some character cards. Some other X-Men that Colossus, another version of Colossus than in other X-Men movies. Damn it. And it's it's controversial if it actually take place takes place in the in X Men universe. Well, you can think of it as, as some kind of um, X Men multiverse. And they commonly make fun of it. And. Every time when Deadpool comes to the to the X Men mansion, there are new excuses why no other X Men's are around. Deadpool, the numbering card, I have the number of two hundred seventy four. It's actually the same number as in the other edition. It's great. Uh, film and editions are great. Uh, the, this quality is, is simply is simply great. Uh, some beautiful. Beautiful artwork with this backside like the booklet in this in this edition. It's really great that they make um, different goodies for different uh, full slips, and also there are lots of goodies in comparison to some other editions where you some you have only three cards. So now the next edition. Some character cards. These cards I actually like more. Somewhat with uh, some kind of Instagram filter. The numbering card, I store it always that way in, in some of the bags with the other character cards because it fits really nicely. I don't like this to store it on, on the outside of the box. Because it's uh, so it don't get damaged uh, by other well by other editions on the on the shelf. Well, the cards and these these cards are very very beautiful. The world tour of Deadpool. Greetings from London. Beijing, Peking. Paris. Berlin. And so on. Prague. So, now to the Deadpool 2 full slips. Two from Film Arena. With these J cards. And the J card of the slip sheet edition. Two from Film Arena. With this incredibly beautiful artwork. Uh, well, especially the kind of this complex, beautiful structure with the unicorn.
and the another the lenticular full slip it's just stunning this, I, I love this 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 3, 3d picture is is just beautiful and here's the back side And uh, the German slip sheet, uh, full slip, this artwork. Uh, this hard box is actually not a one-click box. There is also a Maniac Deadpool 2 box. It's That's a one-click box. So there are actually three Filmariner full slips. Third one I don't have. Now to the content of the three, this three full slips. Um... Well, everyone, which of uh, them has a book and some cards. The Filmarin editions have the same still book that they will show in a minute. And the Slipshoot edition has another still book, which, which is fortunately not this red, red one. Well, we begin with this edition and this uh, art booklet. The third edition is uh, Excel uh, Full Slip, the third film marine edition. Uh, it has uh, this, the very same still book. All the editions have the same still book. It's, I suppose, uh, ex uh, film marine exclusive still book. One of the most beautiful still books that I ever ever saw that I that I have. It's incredibly beautiful. Um, <clears throat> well. Um, Except of that, there are some booklets. Excel edition is not that much bigger as than the the normal edition. The only difference is that character cards has no have normal size. It's the only 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 difference. There is nothing stored um, in in a steel book itself. So, and the problem with an Excel edition, as you all know, Excel edition costs nearly as much as the whole hard box as uh, the two other editions together um, so I decided not to to buy it at least for now uh, that's um, I begin with uh, the other art book well with this beautiful artwork the Excel edition has uh, the similar artwork as the slip sheet edition the only difference the only difference is that it's a double lenticular edition and that's the only um, reason would be the only reason for me to buy it because these lenticulars are simply beautiful uh, i love this this 3d 3d lenticulars with a really great deep effect but deep 3d effect but it's well it's too expensive for what I get at least for now maybe one day I will find it somewhat cheaper so. uh, that's actually artwork from the still book from the slip sheet still book. Uh, well, now to this Deadpool 2 booklet that is resembles some kind of children's book. Uh, it was released alongside several uh, several um, different Deadpool editions worldwide. So it's not exclusive for this edition. It's um, yeah. It's it tells the story of Deadpool two in a children's book format. With this incredibly beautiful drawn pictures. Yeah, it's 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 uh, it's so 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 common for for Deadpool. Simply great. It's not that 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 simple to open it, with some place for the notes. 
up notes and notes before i show you the still books in a minute uh, i will show the goodies we begin with the slip sheet edition because there are not that many of them limited slip sheet edition 666 with this numbering card which is not like a credit card it's just cardboard slip sheet edition 2 the first one was predator and this cards on cardboard one two three and uh, four of them and that's it well now to the film RNA editions there are some more stuff with these beautiful numbering cards 750 copies <clears throat> the second numbering card very nice and this character cards and normal cards and the special cards I suppose they called special cards very nice quality and it's it's one of the it's well it's really controversial about this slip sheet edition the quality of it it's nowhere near it's nowhere near uh film arena quality It's it's an attempt to copycat the full slip editions from other countries, but well, for now it well it's it's okay at best. There was an offer on Amazon Germany, so I. I thought I'd buy it because I didn't have another still book. This other still book, uh, this other still book is um, from Slipshirt Edition. Is you can buy it separately. It's not that expensive. It costs, I suppose, fifteen euros or something like that. So well, the character cards in the second edition. I'm looking for the third part. I, uh, I hope they they make one. It's, it's well, it's it has advantages that that uh, Disney bought uh, Fox, because uh, now X Men can be brought into MCU. But well, we'll see which influence it will have on on such projects as Deadpool three, because. Fox would, 20th, 20th century Fox would for sure make a third part, but well, we'll see if Disney will do it. Very nice pictures. This nice friendly boy. <laughs> There's one more thing. Um, Film Arena has a special goodie in, in their real one click box maniacs box except of an excel version there is also this collector's box with with the similar artwork as um of the still book uh but of the red still book but it's at least embossed now here's the box special collector's gift well uh not that much of a gift it's too expensive for it now in this box is this special gift very very nice with the still book artwork now finally to the three still books one from the Silpshoot Edition, Film Arena one, and um, and the generic one from the French box with this incredible lenticular cover that is provided alongside the non-lenticular edition. Stunning. Simply stunning. Now to compare different editions, at first the Slipshoot Edition 
It's very very nice and I especially like the back side. This cool metallic effect. It's not embossed but it's really cool. This is a stunning still book. Filmar in a still book. With also a hard box um, artwork and artwork that I showed you on the poster from the French edition. And this stunning backside. Incredibly beautiful. And as a comparison, this uh, this uh, generic still book. To compare the spines, these two are pretty similar, but this one is. Yeah, it's okay. And here's what's inside in all three of them both uh, the normal card and super duper extended card. No once upon a Deadpool. And in the slip sheet edition, actually, uh, it's an, a 4K Ultra HD only edition. There are no Blu rays, only 4K Ultra HD. Now, what's inside? It's the artwork from the slip sheet from this generic steelbook. The artwork from Filmar in a steelbook, well, it's, it's okay, but not as stunning as the outside. This still book is wow, it's it's so beautiful, it's incredible, and that's well, that's the artwork inside of the red still book, of course, and it's the same artwork as on the special collector's gift from Film Arena. Well, folks, that was it. It's I suppose my longest video today. Uh, how did you like Deadpool and Deadpool 2? Let me know in the comments below. Leave a thumb up and subscribe to my channel. Till the next time. Bye bye.